Hey everybody, Steve here. So, I am going to be doing a uh, review on a product called Widen Contour Gauge with two pieces. It's made in China. And I guess it came from Amazon, is that right, dear? Mm -hmm. It comes from Amazon. It comes in a box like this. This is the box. Really small. And then inside the box you got a a millimeter, 20 millimeter ruler and a sleeve. You have two contour gauges. And I'm going to show you if you're not familiar with what a contour gauge is. I'm going to give you a, uh, a demonstration. So you have this size and then a bigger size <clears throat> and this is the bigger size. I think for what I'm getting ready to do this second I'm going to use the bigger size and it has uh, millimeter markings and inch markings on it. So you have two levers on each end and those levers lock it in place. So I'll unlock it, unlock both of them and you can see that it, it moves and then you can lock them down and they stay put and you can transfer it onto the board for your cut. So let me show you what I'm fixing to contour here. Guess we'll just put them all down. Put them all down. So I'm using the big one because it's a pretty big contour that I want to do. Hang on just a second. Go ahead. Right. So I'm going to be doing a contour of the steps just to see. up with right there. So if this, this is just a scrap piece of wood, but if I was going to put this wood here and I wanted it to fit just right, I would take and trace my contour on there. Oh, I forgot to tell you, it comes with this pencil too. Made in China. The pencil sharpener almost didn't sharpen it. Must have been some really hard lead. There we go. So now I can cut that board. My line, a little doodicky there. I can cut that board and it'll fit just, just right. So let's play some more. Let's go around the corner. See what we get going around the corner. Oh, that's pretty cool. So that's that corner post going around that corner. So, we'll take it, put this on this edge right here, the board. So if we cut that out right there, that'll go around the corner and go just like that. 
And the little small one only has one locking piece, one locking thing, which is probably not a bad thing. It only has one. Let's see. So we could do that with this one right here. It's going to be a handy tool. <clears throat> I'm excited to to actually put it to work instead of just giving you all a demonstration. Um, it, it's it feels like it's made well. The pieces move fairly easy. So if you had one big board and you wanted to stick it in here just... that probably would work oh look that wall's not straight there that. see that wall wasn't straight so you would, couldn't put a straight board in if you were trying to do that corner either. that comes in handy you're laying floor and you don't want to have to cut out underneath here if you want a nice tight fit take your contour gauge push it up against there Lock it in place. So that's what you need for your boards. So you got one board. Let's we'll start. Well, let me see. Actually, we'll start right there. So I'm going to unlock this one. Alright, so right here, we're putting down another board. This is where our con where we, we would start our, our contour would be right here on the next board to go around this door jam. So we would <coughs> take our piece of floor, set this on the piece of floor like this. On the edge right here, down on this edge that's going up against it, and then we would trace and around here, and then we would we would take our jigsaw and cut it out, or whatever it is that you need to use. The smaller one worked seemed like it worked a little better for that, and that's our door jam right there. Pretty doggone close to where we started at the end of the board there. <clears throat> Alrighty, and these came from Amazon? I'll put a link in the description box below. And what was the cost? I don't know, I'll put a link in the description box below. Alright, well, I know that I'm going to enjoy having these. I know that Valerie will probably get some use out of them too. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe if you want to. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And we'll catch you all on the next video. Bye.